What is up party animals? How are you guys doing today? I am so incredibly excited to start playing this for you. This is How to Full Boyfriend and if you are not familiar with what it is, you're, if you're looking at this and saying what the heck am I watching, please don't, don't leave the video yet. We're gonna jump right in and get started with this. I've been like told so much about this and so like psyched about it. Welcome to St. Pigeonations. That's what we're gonna call it, Pigeonations. Uh, welcome to St. Pigeonations. Please enter your name. Um, yeah, my name. My name is not Hayoko. Uh, we're, we're gonna call. We're gonna be. Um, I don't know if we're like a boy or a girl. We're gonna just go with a boy. Um, Jimmy. We're gonna be Jimmy. My last name, Tosaka. <laughs> Jimmy Tosaka. <laughs> Jimmy, um... I want to say Eats World. No, that's that's a band. Um, oh, can we be Jimmy Neutron? We're going to be Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> I'm so excited. Is Jimmy Neutron okay? Jimmy Neutron is more than okay. Uh, yes, Jimmy Neutron is perfectly okay. Powerful Boyfriend includes a powerful visualization module allowing even the birdiest of birds to appear as normal humans when first introduced. Wow. Display human portraits? Um... I don't... Do we... Uh... At first? I wanna... Sure. Configuration is saved. What are we? I don't know what we're doing. Saint Pigeonations, a school blessed with extensive curricula and faculty. It's already been a year since I ended my ordinary life and walked through these gates. I should probably say the school is known for one thing in particular. This school is Japan's, no, the world's greatest gathering place for gifted birds. Birds who want to study the arts, the sciences, even sports, all come to St. Pidgey Nations. The teaching staff and student body are both made up of a diverse blend of birds of different backgrounds and species. I'm often asked why I chose to come here, despite not being a bird. It's a long story. Not every day I see you rushing along like this. Ryuda! Usually you'd have been ready for an hour. Usually you'd have been ready for an hour by now, Jimmy. Overslept? <laughs> this Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> this rock dove is named Kar Karla <laughs> This is gonna be so bad. This, this game's full of Japanese names, I think. This rock dove is named Kawa Kawara Ryuta. <laughs> We've been friends since he was barely hatched. Is that also him or is that me? I think that's also him. He can be a little mischievous, but he's responsible and kind. Breakfast was a little hard to catch today. I can't relax without red meat inside. Oh man, yeah. Living as a hunter, living as a hunter-gatherer sounds tough. I'd be happy to make you breakfast, you know. Thanks, Ryuda. I might take you up on that offer when starvation looms. Thanks, Ryuda. Oh, the bell already? Come on, we need to hurry to class. Jeepers. No good being late on the first day. <laughs> Jeepers. Beautiful. And so Ryuta pulled me along into the school. Today is the start of a new semester. I wonder what lies in store. It was all I could do to adjust to the atmosphere last year. Better make up for all that lost fun. The most splendid and greatest academy of the pigeon. By the pigeon. For the pigeon. First term. 
I think we're in 2-3. Ryuta and I are in the same class again. 2-3. Who says that? How would you... Whatever. Don't judge me. Old faces, new faces. A strange thrill fills my heart as I look around at the assembled birds. I hope we all get along. Here's to the formation of many happy memories. Oh, the teacher's here. Good morning, everybody! <laughs> I love that. Er, uh, I'm Nam Na Nanaki? Can I say that? Nanaki, yes. Ka Kazuki. Er, uh, I'm Nanaki Kazuki. I seem to be your teacher this year. I specialize in math and physics. And also some other things. I'm sorry if that snore was really loud. Sir, wake up! His homeroom! He slips with his eyes open. <gasps> there we go, okay, yeah. Uh, this quail is Nanaki Kaizuki. He's famously super fork. He's a famously soporphoric math professor. I don't know what soporphoric means. I'd heard the rumors, but I hadn't expected him to fall asleep just like that. Oh, okay. One of those, it's like the thing where you fall asleep instantly, or like anywhere, anytime, sort of thing. Apparently, he's well known as a mathematician. Just goes to show great minds come in all forms. Oh, I'm sorry. Isn't it a little warm in here? Which reminds me, we have a transfer student. Please introduce yourself. Sh Shirogane? Shirogane? What's the point? I have no wish to speak with commoners. Do not think I'm here because I wish to be. Oh well, I guess that's that. Oh, that's him again. They look, they look kind of the same. So. Oh well, I guess that's that. Hey, 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 that's no good. I forget what his voice is. But he doesn't want to introduce himself. But we can't just let him break the rules like that, sir. The system will collapse and we'll all be turned into kulaks and dissenters. Well, when you put it like that, could you at least say your name, Shirogane? <laughs> Shirogane le Bersaki Sakuya. <laughs> oh man, you are stuck up. It seems this fantail is Shirogane Sakuya. His feathers would make any birdie proud those eyes like oh my word he's pretty stuck up but then transferring is never easy I hope we can be friends Sakuya sits down glaring daggers at Ryuta and me I think this little birdie is telling me there's going to be trouble down the line lunch already today is slipping by so quickly that reminds me I've had these books out from the library all summer. I'll return them now. Oh man, they're gonna they're gonna charge you so much. Where is everyone? Aside from the receptionist, there's hardly any bird here. Huh? Is someone looking at me? Probably just my imagination. Or not. A morning dove stands in the dark corner staring in my direction. Morning doves aren't very common in Japan. They're everywhere in America. Um, did, did you want something from me? <laughs> he looked away. Not, not really. I'm pretty sure it was him who I felt looking at me. There's no one else here. Are you sure? Yes, I don't want anything with you. It's the things you're carrying that I'm interested in. Oh, snap, she wants the drugs. Except it's a he, I think. He wants the drugs. 
He glances at the desk as if to say, hurry up and return them already. Oh, sorry. <laughs> they were a little too dense, so I never finished them. Were you waiting for them all summer? He silently returns his gaze to his book. Maybe he's in a bad mood? I'm Neutron Jimmy, a sophomore. <laughs> what about you? <laughs> Neutron Jimmy. <laughs> okay. What about you? You're... Nageki. Nage... Nageki. That's what we're gonna call him anyway. Nageki. <laughs> oh my word, no. Fujishiro. Fujishiro. Fujishiro Nageki. Freshman. Fujishiro Nageki, huh? Morning doves are pretty rare in Japan. I really, I'm enjoying these, like, because you can see, like, the hints of green around his eyes, and that, it's cool. It's cool. Maybe it's just his voice, but he seems kind of sad. Leave me alone. <laughs> He's reading his book again. Okay. Sorry to bother you. I keep meeting depressing people today. It's a sign. Now that I have that out of the way, I think I'll head back to class. Wait. Isn't that... You should have been instructed not to approach me in school. Come on, Sakuya. What kind of thing is that to say to your own brother? After all these years. Oh man, it's a birdie showdown. So, um, I, I take it that's uh, Yuya, and that's Sakuya. <laughs> My brother, you must be joking. You've never once been a brother to me. Oh, man. Please don't try talking to me again. Oh, please don't try talking to me again. I have no time for half-breeds. I'll be going now. Hey, just wait a... You don't want anything to do with him anymore. I guess even if we're in the same school now... What's done is done. I hadn't meant to eavesdrop, but I think I just overheard something juicy. The ever-popular trendsetter and ladies' man, Sakiyaki Yuya, is Sakuya's brother? Shocking. I wonder what the story is ba I wonder what the story behind that is. I wonder too. But we're gonna get to that story next time on How to Boyfriend. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like, uh, hit drop a drop a comment if you want. What I don't know, um, stuff. Yeah, you know the outro. Thank you guys for watching. Tune in next time. I don't know when I will have uh, the next episode up. I'm gonna try. I guess I should come up with a schedule for these. I'm gonna try to have them all up. I don't want to like be too like sporadic with them, but you know. Yeah, we're gonna find out next time what happened to these two brothers. Drop a comment letting me know what you think it is. If you already know, make something else up because I don't want you to spoil it. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. As always, behave your butt, stay smexy, y'all. Deuces.